My name's Jeroen, I'm one of the uh, three co-founders of Spire. Um, my background's in aerospace engineering, so um, very early on that was a lot of screwing things in satellites and soldering wires and, and doing things um, hands-on. Um, today I'm the CTO, so I'm more in charge of um, leading the team that looks at the next generation technologies, new markets, new products, um, and make sure we're aligned with the business on that. Um, as someone that has seen you know, Spire's technology evolution over 10 years, I think one thing to note is that we're a very iterative company. Um, so we start small, we start with a couple of features that we think make sense for our customers, and then we start building um, features on top of that and capability on top of that. And we found that that's a really good way to get to you know, very excellent capabilities um, by starting small, getting feedback from your customers, and then uh, improving things. Um, doing that, you've, we've started from just developing CubeSats with, with limited capabilities to really having one of the best networks in the world with um, capabilities that nobody else has. What excites me today about what Spire is doing is just what we can enable for our customers. You know, we've built a lot of infrastructure on the ground and in space, and we're opening up the ability to do new things in space to a lot of people, either by using the data that comes down from uh, our constellation or by enabling custom applications in space. And I think that's really the goal of anybody today that's operating in, in the space industry, whether it's launching big rockets so that you can get more applications in space or enabling your customers to do it through software um, like we're doing or through custom applications. So whatever that is, you know, we'll, we'll see the creativity of our customers um, developing and deploying these applications that will be able to help people on Earth. As part of our mission to enable more customer applications on our constellation, one of the features we're building is a satellite, which is bigger than what we've built in the past. Um, and it just enables you know, different types of payloads, different types of systems to be flown using our existing um, satellite subsystems and, and existing infrastructure in orbit, uh, which enables a whole new range of applications for our customers.